So, get ourselves rolling again. And now we're in France and we have to drive on the wrong side of the road. Yes. Because almost everywhere on earth drives on the wrong side of the road, <laughs> I noticed. Yeah. It's only us who drives on the correct side. The superior culture. <laughs> we invented sides of the roads so that you should yeah. drive on. We didn't invent the car, did we? Uh, or did we? I don't know. I know the well. The combustion engine was definitely uh, a British invention, but I'm not sure if we invented the car. Mm. Uh, almost got to the top. Uh, can uh, he make it? Struggling. There we go. Okay, take this a bit. Ooh, that wasn't wide enough. Uh, oh, that was that was okay. Got away with it. Oh, you got to turn again. I'm going to take this one a bit more. Back to England. <coughs> a bit on the wide side. There we go. <laughs> yeah. you got to watch that trailer because it comes in quite a bit on you when you're when you're taking those corners. You have to take have to take the corners quite wide. I've noticed that the draw distance in your rear view mirrors isn't that great. Uh, that seems okay. I mean, I haven't really, I haven't really noticed it's that bad. I haven't really noticed any objects disappearing in it. I have. But you can't you can't see very far just because it's a small it's a small picture. I can see very far. Now No oh god you're doing this too fast. Uh, uh you broke you're now stopped on a serious road and ah oh, there's a bus coming and oh everything's on fire. Ladies and gentlemen who are watching this, I want you to close your eyes and I will describe what's happening because I'll make it interesting. Oh god, there are prostitutes everywhere and they're all on fire. <laughs> Damn man, this isn't Grand Theft War! <laughs> See, you say this game isn't exciting, Matt, but things like that happen. <laughs> you mean that tiny thing that happened in the corner of the screen that probably most of the people watching weren't paying attention to? <laughs> And that you will have to point out in editing so that people can see <laughs> why you were so excited just now. Is that the thing you were referring that was, to? That was incredibly tense, Matt. <laughs> that was incredibly tense. Come on. Yeah, I just about caught it on the corner Where's of your, my eye. See, okay, I somehow clipped through the barrier there. Because it's a badly designed game. It's, it's too narrow. Oh, I just took out a street sign. <laughs> Is that fine? Uh, apparently yeah. not. I didn't get fined, so... It's a French street sign. No one cares. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. You li I, I actually... One thing about this is there doesn't seem to be any toll roads. There's loads of toll roads in France. Yeah, yeah. Because that's, that's how they, they don't have road tax. They just pay for, uh... Yeah. <coughs> pay for the roads using those toll roads. Why so. is this guy stopped on a sip road? Why can no one drive properly in this game including you? Oh, uh, someone in front of him had stopped for some for some daft reason. Still someone had stopped. Ah, uh, duh. It's just uh. Quickie, <coughs> 110 kilometers an hour. I'm not sure how that converts into miles per hour. Well, just drive fast. We got cheese to the other damn yeah. it. <laughs> Okay, so I have six hours to left to deliver this cheese. Let's see how far we got to go. So I've got to go through Lille, through Luxembourg, and then in, arrive in Metz. Faster, man. <coughs> Pedal to the metal. Yeah. Press that button as hard as you can. It ca literally cannot be pressed any harder. Yeah. It's raining outside, and uh, the room we're currently in is beau. Yeah. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> I'm trying to find things to talk about. We're playing Euro Truck Simulator. Come on, man! There's so <laughs> many. There's so many. Look, that guy is an arsehole. He's Wait, not an actually, arsehole. no. Actually, we're on the wrong side of the road, so he's not an arsehole. Yeah. That's actually the correct overtaking lane. Yeah, he was completely legitimate in what he did. Okay, you're an arsehole for calling him an arsehole. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so. Oh, Limit's going down to 90. I think 9... I, th I don't know. I think... I think 100 kilometers per hour is around 60. 60. Yeah, around 60. Oh, I better slow down. Uh, jump cut. Uh, another jump cut. Yeah, another jump cut. Alright, so what was I saying? I don't know. Something about this game being very boring. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, the company I... I I created because you, 
you start your own sort of haulage company when you uh, when you create your profile for this game. So I called it Sabbath Haulage Ooh. because I'm a big Black Sabbath fan. And I thought that was quite clever. No. <laughs> <laughs> well, I thought it was good. <laughs> um. Oh, better take this corner a bit slowly. Oh wow, wow! Don't even pretend to give us a bit of excitement. Why didn't you do it on f well, one wheel, going at seven hundred <laughs> times speed? Because I there. fucking flipped the truck over. Yes, <laughs> something would happen. <laughs> <laughs> the most interesting thing in this entire journey is you crashing into someone else. You're saying that wasn't exciting? I just said that was the most interesting thing that happened. Well, in this it journey. was. It was interesting. Oh, I need to get over and let this guy in. Yeah, so he didn't stop on a silk road. Well, sometimes you have to. I, I just slowed down, and to be fair, I was going like uphill, so you know, yeah. don't overtake me on the outside lane, you fucking asshole. Can you ram cars off the road? Uh, yeah, but you get fined. Well, I don't know. Actually, I never tried to ram a car off the road. I don't know if it quite works like that. This is not Grand Theft Auto, Matt. This is Truck Simulator. I would have. This thought... is a serious game. <laughs> Yeah, but it's not a, it's not a game for pissing around. It's a game for serious trucking enthusiasts. <laughs> I thought this was a realistic depiction, <coughs> depiction of what you could do in a truck, aka driving I don't, someone off the road. <laughs> I don't think you could literally push someone off the road with a truck. You probably would. No, you could, you yeah. probably would damage your truck. You could push someone off the road with a truck. You weigh considerably more than them. Than them. It's all about momentum. Yeah, but it, it's it's also a case of you know how much damage you would do with your truck and how far you'd actually be able to to ram them before yeah. it just fucked your truck up. No, nah, I'm pretty sure you could ram pretty far. <coughs> I think we should test this. No, I think we should not test this. Yeah. <laughs> I think your idea is silly and you are silly. I think you know I'm right. And that's <laughs> why. You <laughs> that's why you don't want to uh, don't want to have fun. While watching, what world are we on? The A25. Wow, on the A25 in France. Look at it? that. Look at that. What are those things in the distance? Those things. Those big, uh, like, onion looking things. They're French things. I, I don't know. I, what, I, you see them all the time when you're driving around different places. And, oh, what the fuck are they? I was a little kid. I thought it was the ground. Ooh, I went out to the hard shoulder a bit. <coughs> Sorry, Carrot, continue. Oh, it's made me giggle, those sort of things, because it looked like someone who was desperately, desperately holding in the piss, <laughs> the need to piss. Because yeah. I can be very childish when I was young, you know, about four. <coughs> <coughs> what do you What do you mean it looked like someone who needed to hold in piss? Because it's a... I mean, if I explain the joke, it's no really point. To okay. Me. But I should say it's a penis and it's in, it's eon. Oh uh, right, right. I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how. In, that's you know all I can really <coughs> say because we're playing truck simulator <laughs> two. You're not even trying to come up with interesting things. I can only no. go so far with the material available to me. Right. So we just gone past Lille. I think that's how you pronounce that. Yeah. So we got a. Fair way to go before we reach uh, reach Mets. Can we turn the but sat nav off and just have well like on schedule? A, can we turn the sat nav off and just have like an arrow of where we're supposed to be and forge our own path? Uh, well, to be honest, there's only really. I mean, look. Can we go through France? We're in France. Can we go through Germany. Uh, no, it's too much. Too far out of the way. Can we go through Russia? <coughs> no, <laughs> Russia is not in this game. There is there is an expansion where you can have Eastern Europe, which is quite cool. Can we go through Portugal? No, there's no Spain. There's literally the if you look at this map here, it's it's basically kind of the uh, the east of France, north of Italy, Germany, uh, Austria, and some of Eastern Europe. Can we go to this place via Verona? Where's Verona? Maybe it's on the map. Is Verona on here? Yeah, it is. Where's Verona? It's that one down there. Fucking that's <laughs> that's literally pointless if we go back on ourselves. It would have a sense of adventure. <laughs> you telling me this isn't adventurous? I've never been to this city before. You haven't been to that city now. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, in this game, obviously. Okay. Uh, what's this sign? 
Whoa. Are there ramps in this game? <laughs> there's no ramps, there's no speed boosters, there's no power ups, <laughs> there's no red shells. <laughs> okay. That would be funny though. It would. It would make the game fun. Okay. You can drive one of those. Look at that. Whoa. With the cars on it. There's another can one you get out of the truck and start and drive one of the cars off the truck? <sighs> no. In motion. I told you this is not Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> I'm sure you could do that in Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> Okay. <coughs> Making sure we're in the right lane. And this is a bit narrow, so I'm going to have to take this a bit carefully. Or not, and add some excitement. Alright, I'll just go. I'll just bolt down here at 40. Oh, 40, you renegade. <laughs> I know. What's I'm a risk taker. What's that, five miles an hour? <laughs> what? 40 miles, oh, 40, oh, 40 kilometers. Yeah. No, I, I was talking about, I'm going to take it at 40 miles per hour. Oh, I see. Although I, ooh, I couldn't because, uh... You just weren't mad no, enough. No, it was just going uphill, so I lost you the speed. You weren't man enough. <laughs> right. My, my sleep icon is now red, so I'm going to start to, uh, get tired. You might hear me yawning. Oh, no. Every I'm, now and then. Well, I won't, but... Oh, yeah, you haven't got headphones on, but... No. Those watching this video will hear me yawning. <laughs> No, that wasn't the video. That was me. <laughs> that actually, is a pretty good, uh, pretty good impression of what it sounds like. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> look at this. Look at this view. Isn't that nice? You know, the storm isn't clouds and the rainy night. And yeah, the, and it's the nice fact, though. Fact, can the lightning hit the truck? Uh, that's never happened to me. Do you get uh, bolt lightning? Do you get. You do. You do get weather. There's there's, there's rain and you know. I think there's a mod where you can get snow as well. Oh wow. Can you get a tornado? Uh I've never seen a tornado. I don't I doubt it. I very much doubt it. Can you drive up a volcano? Why would you <laughs> Cuz you're delivering saying to the top <laughs> to the volcano. To the top of the volcano, the guy living there. The, the guy living at the top of the volcano. The volcanologist. Of an active volcano. A volcanologist that studied Why would the why would a, why would a, why would a volcanologist need something to be delivered in a truck? Cuz maybe it's really big volcano analyzing equipment that requires a truck to do it up there. What? <sighs> Matt. Yeah. Just no. Just no. Uh, if I was editing this, I'd get the biggest bit of volcano <laughs> equipment I could find. <laughs> I'd put a picture of it right there. <laughs> I won't be doing that. <laughs> I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen, what I just said was interesting. <laughs> but it won't be happening. Because nah. I'm not editing. Not on this. Oh, shit. Not on this video. I'm getting tired. Uh, okay. We've got. Still got a little bit to go. I'm going to go through. Luxembourg. If you fall asleep, does Freddy Krueger attack you? Yes. Okay. Yes, Freddy Krueger does attack you. Okay, fair enough. And he steals your lorry. Yeah. And you get fined. <laughs> you get fined. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm trying to find a fascination that apparently Eurogamer has with this game. Well, it is. It is. It just is what it is, man. It just fuck. It's just fucking fun. Driving a truck around. Can you get a monster truck? No. Can you get one monster of Monster trucks are not designed for delivering cargo. Can you get one of those dinosaur monster trucks that you see in <laughs> <laughs> Monster Truck in the, shows. In the Simpsons. Truckosaurus! Yeah, can, can you like, run around the city in Truckosaurus? <laughs> uh, delivering cargo. Alright, this isn't Blast Core. <laughs> you can do that in uh, Yago City Undercover. Oh, can you? Yeah, there's a mechanical ro there's a mechanical dinosaur. You can have, get. You pl have you played that? Yeah, a bit of it. Yeah, is it any good? It's all right. It's got a good amount of charm to it. I suppose if you get past the ego, the fact that it's the ego game, it's 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 very cliche. -y. I mean, all the other detectives that work with you, they're yeah. all people. They're all famous detectives from dramas. You know. Oh right. So yeah. have you got like? Um, 
Oh, uh, what's what's the name? What's the name of the really shabby guy who's on American TV? Uh, Columbo is Columbo in it. Yeah, Columbo's in it. Fucking awesome. Columbo's in it. Dirty Harry. Is Magnum PI in it? Yeah. Dirty yeah. <laughs> Fucking uh, Magnum PI. Uh, Dirty Harry's in it. Sherlock Holmes is in it. Nice. Um, um, uh, Starsky and Hutch. Nice. Are in it. So yeah, it's kind of it's massively parodied. It's you know there's a bit of charm to it. That was coming out soonish. The Ego movie. Uh, I'll look forward to that. That should be good fun. Yeah, I saw a trailer for it the other day. It was. Uh, I mean, it's it's an interesting con. Well, Yago has the potential to basically do the most absurd film ever made. Yeah. Because but do, would they have to like re get all of the licenses that they've, they've got, got all the licenses? Yeah, but I mean, to do it as a film, wouldn't they have to get another license to do it as a film? I'm not so sure because uh, remember Yago gets a lot of money but so do the people that they license yeah so they could say oh you don't want me to license well I'm not going to do any more Yago products for any of your things mm. yeah I suppose I mean it's a huge industry Yago yeah do you know Lego makes uh, makes more tyres than uh, than Goodyear <laughs> every year they make more tyres than Goodyear yeah yeah but yeah uh, I, my only thought is in a Yago film they've just got to go completely over the top balls to the walls yeah, they gotta have Batman beating up Iron Man. Well, I just, I just, when I when I heard, first heard about a Lego movie, I thought, ah, it's gonna be a fucking CGI film. Like, I don't, I don't care. I'm not interested. When I saw like it was gonna be a, a stop start motion yeah. animated film, I was like, fuck, they're actually doing a proper Lego film about the kind using I'd, Lego. About the kind I do when I was a little kid. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, that killed a few minutes. Uh, <laughs> All right, it's time to get tired. It's really not noticeable. <laughs> well, it will it will start to happen soon. Soon I'll start to black out. Almost there though. Mm. I think we're in. Hang on, let's check the map. Yeah, we're in. Uh, we're in Belgium now. I think we just crossed over to Belgium. Wasn't there anything? Like a well, there would have been a sign saying "Welcome to Belgium" or "Bienvenue bien à Belgium." Like a toll booth or something. <laughs> no, there's there's no toll roads. Mm. Although I don't know, I I swear I've I've seen in other videos there are toll roads, but I've just not come across them. Maybe they're only in the expansion. <laughs> you have to buy the expansion to pay for driving on the roads in this game. Mm. Ah, look at that bridge. It's a bridge. It's not like I see those every day while driving. But it's a, f it's a nice bridge. <laughs> it's I can only see its eggs. <laughs> well, I'm not. I'm not looking out the window because that's dangerous. Mm. I'm a responsible driver. <laughs> mm. Oh man. <laughs> I'm just gonna get behind me. I'm just gonna lean out the cab. That's responsible. Yeah, that's responsible. Did you see? Did you see it start to dim there? I thought I was just my eyes unfocusing. <laughs> <laughs> Starting to glaze over. Yeah. Uh, but it's it's a it's a very pretty game, don't you agree? Yeah, it's all right looking, I suppose. It's a, I think it's very look at those sunflowers. Uh. It's so nice. Like even like I was driving down the A12. Like it's a bit unrealistic in that regard, actually, because I was driving down the A12 in this game. Anyone who's ever driven down the A12 know that it's a fucking miserable experience. Uh. But in this game, it's absolutely gorgeous. So it's not realistic in that in so that respect. So this is actually. Not a realistic representation of what it's like to be a truck driver. Um, well, it's not a realistic. It's not necessarily a realistic look at what the what these real life locations are like. Okay. I mean, obviously, there are some aspects of of the real life truck driver lifestyle that you can't, you know, so you can't simulate. So you can't simulate staying in a sleazy, shitty uh, motel. You can't simulate murdering prostitutes or taking drugs. I wasn't gonna go there. <laughs> <laughs> well, fuck it. You you are moaning about having nothing to talk about. I am not gonna demonize our truck driving truck drivers by saying that they're all drunken idiots who murder oh. prostitutes. I didn't say that they all were. That's where you're like, oh, <laughs> you're like, oh, that's the part of truck driving we can't just do in this game. 
you know, the whole murdering prostitutes part of it that they all do <laughs> because Adam hates truck drivers. Yeah. Clearly, that's what's going on here. Yeah, God, cool. you know, it's just like fucking Jeremy Clarkson. You make a joke, <laughs> and everyone goes, "Ew, you can't say that." Because you obviously meant it seriously. Are you defending Jeremy Clarkson? Yes, I am. <laughs> you know, he's like one of the most racist, <laughs> prejudiced... He's not... Is he racist? I don't know. He's, he's not racist. He's probably not racist, but he's an idiot. He's not racist. He is an idiot, though. He... he I don't I don't really agree with his, his right-wing conservative politics. And he is a fucking idiot. Like, like a lot of his opinions are just, like, spouted for comic effect. Mm. Um... But yeah, he does. He does talk a lot of bollocks, mm. some of the time. But when he when you just make a fucking when you're just making a fucking joke, and people are like, oh, you can't say that. It it really it really fucking pisses me off. It really fucking pisses me off. It's like you can't say anything. You can't have any fun anymore because someone will get offended and make you stop. I I would yeah, you continue your rant, Ed, but I'm getting offended. <laughs> <what you're> saying. <laughs> Okay, not long now. We're almost there. Thank Christ. So hopefully, I won't black out before we get there. Wouldn't want something exciting to happen. I might black out before we get there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Can you change your car into Optimus Prime and start fighting Decepticons? Mate, you're just you're just being silly. Whoa! Ooh, that was close. I should have been in the right lane there. You have to. Yeah. No, I meant the correct lane. The right lane is in the correct lane. But your key needs to be in the left lane, not the right lane. Yeah. But the left lane is the right lane. Uh, that's just creating a whole <laughs> <laughs> mess of metaphysics right there. Uh, this is why you don't study language in philosophy. Because <laughs> it's a fucking mess. I, I reckon that's why f German philosophy is so good because I reckon German, the German language is probably a lot more precise and clear and about what words mean and despite the fact it is a relatively nice language it is very aggressive sounding well it, it can it's not necessarily because people often say that when you when you speak German it sounds guttural but that only happens when you go ich liebe dich ich nein fleiner von seiner fleiner and you speak in like a ridiculous Nazi accent but most Germans actually are very softly spoken and, and very nice. Oh, fair enough. Hello! Well, Guten yeah, Tag! That's a German speaking English and saying Guten Tag. Guten Tag! <laughs> but that's how they speak. They're actually very softly spoken. Oh, fair enough. And nice people. Being that I haven't gone to Germany in Euro Truck Simulator 2, <laughs> <laughs> I can't make a comment on this. Yeah. Can you like, go. Can you actually get out of your truck at all? Uh, no, you can't. Why, why happens if it's on fire? Um, you know, I never, never, never come up. Never come up. I'll get back to you on that. Okay. Maybe, I mean, maybe if you can, I think you probably could total your truck. You probably could have it so bad that it just has to be written off. Have you total your truck? <laughs> no. <laughs> I paid a lot of money. I'm still paying off the loan for this truck. Okay. No, you have to. You have to take out a loan. I had to take out a loan to afford this, and it is probably like the. It's one Taking of the, like, out loans yeah. and driving around the truck, obeying the speed limit. <laughs> this is truly a game for the ages. Observing <laughs> the rules of the road. <laughs> yeah. Well, you're not, because you crashed into someone earlier. Well, that was that wasn't my fault. And you. And yeah. I'm, and you're now doing that. And you're I'm doing. Yeah, right I shouldn't end. have been doing that, but. Nah, yeah, fuck it. Yeah. You can get away. You can get away with a lot of shit. Like you don't have to signal. You should signal. You should, you should signal. No, I mean, don't mean in real life. I mean, in this game, you don't have to signal. So it's, you know, telling young kids playing this game that they don't have to signal. And they're going to get up <laughs> and they're going to all die because of this game. Can't imagine there are many young kids playing this game. I can't imagine there's many of anyone playing this game. <laughs> there, you'll be there's actually quite a lot of people playing this game. There's quite, there's quite, there's actually quite a bit. This game has got quite a bit of. Whoa, shit! Oh shit! I didn't crash. Okay, fuck. <laughs> that was scary. It wasn't. That was no. It, it really fucking was. It wasn't scary. It oh was. man, I got fined for sleeping. <laughs> How did anyone know I was sleeping? I don't know. 
maybe Batman was And my, my thing didn't go down though, so it clearly wasn't that much of a sleep. Man. That was that was scary. That really was scary. That wasn't scary. That was actually interesting. Yeah, my wipers on. Oh wow, fucking wipers. Hey, you discovered Mets! Discovered a new city. So we're almost there to deliver our cheese. Oh joy. So green light, hooray! Green light. That's what I like to see. Ooh. Ooh. Take that corner like a pro. Yeah. Oh shit. Uh, get the brakes on. Ooh. I don't know if I have any control over my truck when that happens. I don't think you would in a realistic sense. By the no. way, that's a red yard that you should really stop for. Yeah, I'm going to. You didn't hit that, you were. God damn it, I've got to find a get. Who is this person who's spying on me sleeping? Who knows that I'm sleeping? There's actually someone in the cab next to you, you just haven't turned around. <laughs> to <look at> them. <laughs> <laughs> I watch you when you see. <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> I might, I, I'll see if I could actually shop a person in there in the edit. I'm probably too shit at editing to do it. I could do it, but I'm not editing this one. <laughs> oh. Okay, another red. I'm never gonna make it. Don't you understand, man? Oh, I've got man, I'm actually, I'm actually out of time. Zero minutes. You go for one soon. Probably, probably. The cheese is going to explode and we're all going to die. Come on. Come on. Green light. Red light. Green light. So. It's yeah, great. you can get fined. You can get fined for not having your lights on. You can get fined for. Um, sleeping, apparently. Yeah, sleeping on the job. Okay. You get left signal on. Don't fall asleep. Must. Maybe. Oh shit! Oh god! Oh yeah. fuck! Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I knew. Oh, that was the worst possible time. Yeah, that was the worst possible time for that to happen. Oh. Okay. The worst possible time would be when you're delivering the volcano equipment to the bloke on top of the volcano. <laughs> In my mind. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to find a better game here. Okay. So, I'm going to give this a go. Uh, basically, if you want to deliver your stuff like a pro, you reverse into the space. You, uh, you, you, know, you line it up, you reverse in, I'm gonna try doing. It. If it takes too long, I'll just I'll just skip it because it'll be boring to watch. But I really will be boring to watch. <laughs> okay, so stop here. Oh, I'm just taking a nap. You wake up and you're on top of the volcano and Fuck. things. <laughs> oh my god. That's going to make this more difficult than it really needs to be. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, uh, don't know. I think that's too far off the space. We'll see if it'll let me get away with it. Oh, oh. All right. Detach the trailer. Good work. <laughs> okay, so I got a penalty, but look at that shit. Look at how much experience I got. Yeah, level seven. I can tell you are sharing my enthusiasm right now. <laughs> oh, can't you tell? <laughs> okay, so I leveled up. Right. Put some fucking points in long distance. So now I can deliver deliveries up to 232 miles. Isn't that brilliant, Matt? Well, I think it says 932 miles. Oh, sorry, 930. <laughs> Did I say two? Oh, all right. Okay. It matters not. I think it matters quite a lot. There's a rather <laughs> large difference in distance <laughs> between 232 and 932. Uh, okay. So that was Truck Simulator. Oops. That was Euro Truck Simulator 2014. So, so is, is this game autosave? Yes, it does. So we can't just tr trash your truck now. Just well, hang on. We can... Mm, Let's just say I'll save the game there, because it does auto save, but I can just reload that save. Okay, let's title this fucking thing. 
Yeah. I think this might be more difficult than you think. <laughs> and it's not that realistic. Because <laughs> these are quite easy to total. Come on. Let's just ram someone off the road. Let's give, so let's give our viewers something to actually enjoy okay. watching. You know... <laughs> this is not the way this game is intended to be played. Fuck it, this is the way it should be. If you, you want to do, you do stuff like that, by the way, it's probably. Whoa! No! <laughs> what happened? You fell asleep and you crashed into. Oh something. god, I crashed into those spools. Those empty spools. Quickly, man, start. I can't believe I actually know what a spool is. I'm playing this game too much. Man. Yeah. Quickly, ram someone off the road. Damn it, there's no one here! <laughs> Run that red light! <laughs> Fuck you, red light! Yeah, you're, you're like a fucking rebel. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Ah, that was really unsatisfying. <laughs> I told you, man. This is not. This is not the game to play if you want. No, you want to just ram stuff. Ram that eel car. Okay. You Let's see if I can push him off the road. I... Yep. Yeah. yeah, push him off the road. Yeah. 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 Run him over. Yeah. Yeah, uh, you see, you weren't doing this particularly fast. You need to pick up some speed and then right. ram someone. It takes quite a while. Well, actually, because I'm just a cab, it, it won't be as it won't take as long to pick up speed. This, I think they they all yep. <laughs> they all have a speed limiter. It's limited at around 50 miles per hour. Yeah, there's a car. Boom! Ooh, yeah. And with that. <laughs> Alright, well. You're a long way off <laughs> Damn it, you're the ones that are wrong! Yeah. Alright, I think we'll we'll call it a day there. Yeah. As I'm as I'm pushing this car off the road. Okay. That was Truck Simulator. A very, very fun game, contrary to what some people might think. We are never playing this game again! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, bye bye. Bye.